Hi, this is Saad Choudhury, and I'm the founder and technical director at Paradiso Solutions. Today I'm going to talk about utilizing gamification to enhance your e-learning engagement. This is original talk I gave at the Learning Solutions Conference in Orlando, and I'm using a lot of the same material here. Quickly, my story. I was born in India. Uh, and I moved to U.S. to do my master's in computer science. Then I worked at various startups at uh, Silicon Valley. Um, most of those startups went bankrupt for whatever reason. And then I went to Harvard Business School to figure out why those startups went bankrupt. And that's where I really had a turning point where I saw the effectiveness of the teaching methods at Harvard Business School and I got interested in education and educational processes. So after Harvard, I started a company which offers technology for education. So I try to combine a lot of the things I learned uh, at Harvard Business School in terms of the teaching technology, and I combined that with my technology experience in Silicon Valley and started Paradiso Solutions, which offers uh, technology for education. Quick outline of this talk. Uh, this talk is split into many different videos, but basically I'm going to talk about why gamification, what is gamification, how to gamify. So I'll talk about practical case studies and examples, and uh, selection of your learning management platform, uh, some pitfalls, and Q&A. So let's get started. I'll start with a story. Um, at University of Washington, the researchers were struggling with figuring out a uh, structure of uh, enzyme, which is, which is supposed to be part of the whole HIV process. And the problem was pretty complex because to figure out the spatial structure of this enzyme, there were millions of different combinations and per permutations one has to go through. So even the fastest computers um, in biotechnology couldn't solve the problem. So they come up with the idea of creating a model and uploading it on an online game called Folit, where gamers compete for points and they're able to do different combinations and permutations. They're able to chat with each other, so on and so forth. So we are, without going in a lot of details, um, I'll make a long story short. Basically, they posted it, posted the, the problem or the model on this online gaming platform and uh, at in a very short time uh, the gamers were able to figure out a model which is optimum which takes the least amount of energy which means it's aligned with the nature which solves the problem so the reason the the gamers were able to solve the problem because they saw a challenge in it they saw social interactions and that was their motivation. They didn't do it for money, not for Nobel Prize. They were just playing the games and the, the power of their, their, their brain power really helped to, to solve the problem. 